guys, my name is Crystal and welcome to my YouTube channel. Welcome old subscribers, welcome new. If you like my videos, please press the like button and do please subscribe. Alexa, what's the time please? It's 2.57pm. Okay, so I'm just getting on with my life. I, you know, what other people do is their business. I'm letting them get on with their lives and I'm getting on with mine. And that's how it's going to be. I think a camera can be invasive and I don't think, you know, going around with a camera in your hand, taping, you know, it's okay if you're sightseeing and you want, you know, you go to a different country and you want to sightsee and people tend to get in the way of the camera anyway, but I've just changed my attitude and, you know, I want to do positive videos with trying to help people get through things through things that I've been through bullying you know some kinds of torture which isn't always physical domestic violence and race hatred I'm trying to help people I'm not here to upset people I'm trying to help and I don't think going around with a camera you know, videotaping people when they're going about their own business, to me, is the right thing to do. So I've backed off and I'm concentrating on getting myself, you know, better. Trying to, and the, the camera is helping me because what I'm doing is I'm going around my flat with a camera in like messy areas and then I can see what needs to be cleared up. Because when you walk into a room, it's, you know, it can be very large and you can't see what you're trying to clear up. But with a camera, just one area at a time. The thing with me is I suffer from chronic pain and sometimes I, yeah, I find it hard to even just wash up. So I'm going to try really hard to have a go at keeping it tidy. Right, so approximately again half past two, I went out and I looked in my mailbox first. And first of all, I'm going to show you my crystals post. This morning, this morning I spoke to a young lady from Specsavers and she asked me if I was a miss, missus, or mus. This package has got mus. M S. Crystal Marshall, Rochester, Kent, and it's got I am not plastic on the front. I am not plastic. I am made with potato starch. I am a hundred percent compostable. This has been delivered by the Royal Mail to me, Crystal. Ms. Crystal Marshall. A prayer diary. Prayer diary. Tear Times. Tearfund.org. East Africa Crisis Escalate. So it's a little catalogue, spring 2023. It's got thank you for your support for flood hit families in Pakistan. Opening our hearts to God. The grass has disappeared. Desperate families in Kenya face starvation following years of drought in East Africa. Written by Peter Shaw. All our animals have died. We have no water. Thank you for your generous support and prayers. As we start a new year, we are so grateful to all of you who have continued sacrificially giving despite it being a challenging time for many. We've so many urgent issues facing people living in poverty across the world your faithfulness to demonstrate the love of jesus 
in practical ways is hugely inspiring. In the last issue of Tear Times, we highlighted the hunger crisis in Uganda and across East Africa. Sadly, that crisis is continuing to hit families across the region. In Turkana County in northern Kenya, fathers like John are finding it almost impossible to feed their children. It is even more of a struggle for John, who is blind, to support his four young boys. And that's been written by Nigel Harris, signed. I also have a water bill from Icosa. The water here in Rochester is not southern water, it's Icosa. This is your latest water bill. £257.76. Your bill in a nutshell. That's not my mother's water bill, that's mine. So as soon as my mum gives me some money, I suddenly get great extortionate bills out of nowhere. The boring bit. We store all your personal data securely. We use it to provide and manage your water supply and related services. So my mum gives me some money so I can pay my gas and now I've got an almost £300 water bill. So it's given with the one hand and taken with the other, isn't it? I had a cold weather payment from Job Centre Plus on the 16th of December. That came from Wolverhampton. This is from the Motor Neurone Disease Association. Join us and take over motor neurone disease. Do you believe in heroes? I believe you are your own hero. You make your own life story. Wiltshire Farm Foods. Remember this is a backlog of posts from December. A backlog of posts from early December. We're now in January, but because we've got postal strikes here in the United Kingdom, there's a hold up of post. Dear Miss Marshall, we're here to make your life easier, delicious and e effortless. Choose any four delicious dishes for 9.99. Kate at Dartford. Now, this is my son's Christmas card to me, his mum. So, of course, he's put mum on it, mum, on my Christmas card because my son in Gloucestershire sent one to his brother and, of course, I'm his mother. So, mum, and that is Holly. The stamp is Holly, isn't it? It's Holly. Let's open the Christmas card that I never got for Christmas Day. Opening it now. For a lovely mum at this special time of year. That's for my son in Gloucester. He actually he sent me a Christmas card, but the post got so held up. I got no Christmas cards at Christmas from my family in Gloucester. And they didn't get mine because of the postal strikes. And it made me feel depressed and miserable. <coughs> <coughs> because I thought my family hadn't sent me a Christmas card, but they had. full of strikes. The trains aren't running today. I saw the post lady and she was bent over talking to a man and his girlfriend and the man had a beanie hat and glasses 
and she was talking about his dog, their dog. Um, the post lady, I told you, she used to speak to me. She doesn't now. I, it doesn't bother me at all. Because um, that's what happens. People get to know you. And then they turn their back on you. And I'm used to that. It really doesn't matter because I'm my own person now. Um, I will not be used as a toy or a plaything. I'm a human being. And this is the way it's going to be from now on. I'm completely